A bit big for a tracker, isn't it? But they also collect data from the anomalies and are part of the new comm system. With these in, I can monitor and record everything you say while out in the field. Is that necessary? Yeah, of course. If anyone gets into trouble, everyone will know about it immediately. Are these only on during an alert? Philip and Lester want them on at all times, just in case. Right. The range in them is amazing, but unfortunately they will stop feeding back if you go through an anomaly. Well, how is that even an issue? Policy's strict. No one goes through, not for any reason. No, Look, I... everyone has been briefed. Everyone knows the rules. I'm going to hand these out. I wasn't suggesting anyone should go through. He knows. He'll calm down. Oh, hey. Look, I'm so sorry about earlier. It literally took 20 minutes for me to extract my foot from my mouth. Matt had to help and everything. Forget it. I, I completely overreacted. I'm sorry. Look, I know you've been asking around about the old team. That's OK. You can ask me anything you like. I won't bite your head off. Um, well, I know it's probably classified and everything, but there is something that I don't understand. I thought Danny and the others followed Helen Carter to the future. But I've, I've heard people talking about the past, about early humans. When the others didn't return, Sarah deciphered something in Helen Cutter's diary. Site 333, the Rift Valley. It's where the human ancestors evolved. Sarah was always certain that Helen Cutter was going to try and find her way back there somehow. But why? To murder them. To wipe out the human race before it had even started. That woman was seriously messed up. But... But she failed, right? We're still here? Yeah. Seems like it. Your friends figured it out. They stopped her. Yeah. Yeah, I'm here. Oh, hang on. Sorry, Mr. Coltime. Iguanodon in a beauty school. Sounds messy. Best one I've had in a long time. The team are fantastic. Good to hear. Bagger's a pain in the proverbial, but he's good at what he does. What? What's wrong? Matthew, these people will become your friends. It's only natural. But... Gideon, I've been working towards this for ten years. I'm not going to get too close. I'm not going to take any chances. Forgive me. It's only that sometimes... I think this is impossible. Sometimes I think we're going to fail. We won't. But we're running out of time. 